Okay, this is the Baldor 334B, uh, three quarter horse, three phase buffer grinder. Um, looks like it runs on 208 volts or 460 volts. Okay, so I'm gonna about to run this on the Teco FM50 um, on residential voltage. I have it plugged in right here to a 220 15 amp plug. Uh, so I got the switch flipped here. I'm gonna go ahead and dial this up and I'm gonna focus right here when I do it. I want you to know how quiet it runs. And so this is variable speed using the uh, the Teco here so the more juice I give it here the faster she turns and so it's super quiet I'm gonna go ahead and spool it all the way up to 60 okay so that's amped out I believe this motor can do uh, faster than 100 percent because of the way it's wound so if you use a um, Durable frequency drive should be able to maybe go up to one and a half the um, listed 1800 RPMs. And so that's just right there. I'm going to go ahead and uh, use something on this just to see what it's like under load. Okay, I got this piece of steel here. I'm just going to kind of clean it up. You can see it's pretty gnarly. I'll just, I'm going to try to actually stall this out. I'm pushing. Pretty much as hard as I can with one hand. Yeah, it's not even slowing down really. But basically what I'm showing is that the uh, motor has plenty of power and that it's super quiet. That's one of the things that I would like about it. Um, yeah, it seems like it's in this pedestal. I think once you bolt it down, it should hold up pretty good. Or you could take it off and bolt it to something else.